what is a static data member in C++ and how can it be implemented while writing a program? Hello everyone, I am Sukanya from GoEduHub Technologies and in this video we are firstly going to discuss about static data members and then we are going to see that how can we execute a program with the help of static data members in C++. Stat static data members are class members that are declared using the keyword static. There is only one copy of the static data member in the class, even if there are many class objects. This is because all the objects share the static data member. The syntax is, as I have already said, static keyword, the data type, and the variable name which you want to set as static. What are the properties of static? Static members are only declared in class declaration but not defined and they are done with the help of scope resolution operator. Static members are shared among all the objects. That's why they are known as class members or class fields. Static members can be assessed without any object also. So here you have can see that there is a program written over here for the use of static. So you can see here that the keyword, the variable object count is having integer adds as data type and using the static keyword. So this particular variable is static and all the rest other variables in this particular are using this particular object count which is having a static value. And then it is using the object of the check class that is ch for the get value 10 and then the value is set and then particularly changing and at last it is going to see you that how many particular static objects are created so there are four objects created how ch1 2 3 and 4 are the objects created of this particular class C check and then the value is set four times that is 10 20 30 and 40 that's why four separate objects are created and x is being updated updated four particular times now let us execute this program and see how static data members work. Here you can see that I have written the particular program and then I have declared a static variable of the check class here that is static int and the particular variable is object count and this object count variable is used each and every time for the increment or the updation in the x. So this is how that particular value is used and then the value is set that is assessing the static method show. Show is the static method now. Check is the class name and the uh, member function is ch1 and 2 that's getting set the value and then get that particular value then show similarly set the value get the value and similarly show for 30 and then for 40 and at last assessing the static variable object count that means how many time that object is changed or updated that count will be given as i execute this particular program you can see here x is firstly 10 then x gets updated with the help of show get function and then it gets to 20 again the x is updated to 30 and similarly to 40 so the number of object created static objects are four four times that object is particularly created this is how static method works with the help of a static keyword for more programs we will look into upcoming videos thank you